right, moving us into the future of medicine and a possible breakthrough for researchers is a new breast cancer vaccine in its early trial stages right now. And joining us now in studio, WCPO 9 News reporter Kritzia Williams. Kritzia, you sat down with the doctors leading this charge and a breast cancer survivor ready to share a story. Yeah, a clinic in Cleveland is in phase one of three for this new breast cancer vaccine. The trial right now is focused on 16 women who have been taking this vaccine. And I spoke with one lady who says instead of being scared of the cancer returning, she's now focused on living life to the fullest without time running out. I was more fearful of the cancer returning every single day that this was something that I wasn't fearful of. Jenny Davis is a triple negative breast cancer survivor. Um, I was originally diagnosed with triple negative in 2018 and then went through the chemotherapy, double mastectomy, 26 rounds of radiation. This had to have been an emotional roller coaster. Your mom, your, you work full time. What was it like? There's definitely a part of myself that always worried about them more than what I worried about myself for sure. She received that life changing phone call in 2018. And after a long road battling one of the most aggressive cancers, her doctors at Cleveland Clinic had an opportunity she knew she couldn't miss out on a breast cancer vaccine. They released the first part of the data in April of this past year of 23, and it showed that I had built an immune response, which means that the vaccine taught my body to identify these cancer cells and destroy them before they become a tumor. You know, if I have a headache, I really think it's just a headache. I don't think it's a brain tumor anymore. Meet Dr. Amit Kumar. He says Cleveland Clinic and Anixia Biosciences have partnered to put a vaccine in motion. And Dr. Kumar tells me that this has been decades in the making. This is what's known as a prophylactic vaccine. So. Uh, it's kind of like the vaccines that we all hear about for infectious diseases like polio and smallpox and more recently COVID. You take the vaccine when you don't have cancer in your body and the ideal situation would be that your body, your immune system gets trained. Right now, researchers are in phase one, testing the vaccine on triple negative breast cancer survivors like Davis. Primary goal here is to verify that it's safe. Phase two and three go hand in hand, increasing and splitting up focus groups. Then it's to the FDA's desk. Davis tells me she found a lot of hope in this trial and it's truly been a game changer. She says she wants the same feeling for every woman. If this continues on that path, I do believe that. Um, and I'm very hopeful that then it'll just become available for everyone, that my daughters can get it and never have to worry about triple negative. That would be the, the best gift. Ron says that there are two goals here. One, making sure that this vaccine is safe and two, and two ensuring that it, it's affecting the immune system. And at the end of the day, taking away that fear from those women. Kristen. Incredible story, Kritzia. Thank you so much.